Hey guys, this is a special episode for me because I'm not going to talk about any improvements you can make to your store, but it's actually an announcement that I will be developing my first software tool ever, and I'm really excited about it. So I'm creating sort of a follow along journey to kind of document what we're going through as we are developing this first tool. Now, what is this tool? Um, it is actually something really, really special. We noticed that when we went through every single customer we had, uh, that all their Google Analytics data would be missing. You know, they would have 10 to 30% missing data compared to their Shopify or WooCommerce or Magento store. So just dealing with the fact that no one had all their data is something that led me to start building this tool. Um, frankly, the best way I can work with any client is that when I run an A-B test, I can see the, the complete result and I can see all the revenue and everything is tracked perfectly. And with this tool, I'm aiming to do just that. But the tool goes way beyond that because you can imagine if you have your own e-commerce brand or you work with someone, well, if you cannot see all the data, then you cannot really make good decisions. Um, so we want to fix that once and for all. We're really going to be doing this through server-side tracking, which is kind of something that a lot of people are talking about. But we just realized that most uh, brands out there are not really solving this truly server-side. So we're going to be solving that by building a server, hosting a data warehouse, pulling all your data in through API, then we're going to shoot it back out to Google Analytics 4 uh, on a new data layer where you will see every single order, all your revenue, and really it's going to be a game changer for you if you're looking for that one source of truth and being able to make decisions based on your data. So this is launching soon, and uh, I can't wait to kind of share the link, get it up and running. We're going to do a pretty big trial uh, where people can just play with it and not have to pay anything. We just want a lot of people to, to be on this and, you know, really fortunate that a lot of our clients have already said they would love to, to work with the tool and use it on, on a daily basis. Well, the, the tool has been, uh, we've been working on that for two months and it's been a lot of work on the side, but I'm just excited to see it come to live. Um, we're going to be launching it as a an app on Shopify as well so that you can just easily click a few buttons and it's already working. And for you sort of data nerds out there, you'll be amazed to, to learn that not only will we be tracking all the events that Shopify give you, like orders and purchases and revenue, all that stuff, but we will also be allowing you to create new events, which you're used to from Google Analytics, which could be page views and scroll percentages and all these other events that you might want to track, which we use all the time inside of our uh, company. So all that's going to be available to you. And then st stage two and or phase, phase two is going to be um, where we hook up to all your favorite ad platforms like Meta, Google, TikTok, and so forth. And we're going to take all your orders, all your, your data, and shoot it back up to these platforms so that they actually understand every single customer you have. You'll be able to have way more data inside of Facebook, for example, so the algorithm can work better. You see way better results when it comes to your advertising. And we have already done some checks where we saw accounts that sh suddenly got 20 to 30% higher uh, return on ad spend given that they now have so much more data inside. So that's really cool, and it just helps the algorithm fire on all cylinders. And this step, uh, phase three and phase four, is going to be really, really interesting because we are actually going to be launching our own A-B testing software inside of our tool. It's going to be it's going to be exclusive uh, to Shopify in the beginning uh, and allow you to not only do price testing, shipping threshold testing, but also complete design overhauls. We just wanted to simplify launch on the biggest platform first, and then later on we might consider launching on additional platforms. We see a big gap in the market here because no one is doing server-side tracking and A-B testing tools in the same platform. Uh, so combining it all means we have all data, and it also means that we can use stuff like AI in the future to predict where we should be A-B testing, where you should set up your next A-B test, 
but also allowing you to potentially get A-B tests developed by AI and you can launch them with a single mouse click in the future. And that's gonna be really exciting, you know, because no one has kind of combined those pieces yet. Um, finally, we will also be launching stuff like um, apps inside that can really enhance your store. So we'll be doing custom carts. So everything within Revive will be inside of our app in the future. So you can customize your cart and you check out, you can do upsells and cross sells. And the reason why we wanna do that is because it's very difficult to A-B test a custom cart design or like a custom uh, discount ladder or a new uh, upsell system within your store just because it usually runs through an app and you cannot do a real-time A-B test through an app usually. And just being able to put it all together means we'll have a full suite of tools at your disposal. The, the really cool thing here uh, for you as a user potentially is that we will do it at a very affordable rate because we just want it to be that, you know, no brainer for you. Like, oh my God, I'm getting all this stuff, my server side tracking, I'm gonna get, you know, more data in my ads, I'm gonna be getting a custom card, I'm gonna get all my upsells, and I'm gonna be able to A-B testing inside the same tool. That has never been done before, and it just makes it a no-brainer if you can get that for uh, a, a small amount, um, which you would potentially be having to pay for six, seven different tools if you were to get it separately. So anyway, this was just my little spiel. Uh, if you stayed this far, then you might be interested in that. So if you just continue to follow me on my podcast or on LinkedIn, uh, then you will be able to get the latest news on when this launches. Uh, we are only a couple of weeks left uh, away for launching the first phase, which is just a server side tracking. So I'm gonna be posting about this probably once every two weeks or so, just giving you an update on the tool and what we're doing and the challenges and the ups and the downs uh, developing this. But uh, hopefully you'll follow along on this journey and I'm really excited to share more in the future.